This video is to be used for educational purposes only and is not intended to replace individual research or licensed investment advice. Unique experiences and past performances do not guarantee future results. Trading stocks, options, and spot currencies involves substantial risk. There is always the potential for loss. Your trading results may vary. No representations are being made that any software or training will guarantee profits or not result in losses from trading. Hello traders, I'm Andrea Scalise with your market wrap for Wednesday on the James Dix Financial Network. Well, we saw another mixed day on Wall Street today with the Dow closing at 12.577, the Nasdaq closed 24.79, and the S&P at 14.30. Also in the news today, prices paid to U.S. producers last month rose more than forecast, reflecting higher costs for crude oil and gasoline that have since declined. The 0.9% gain in the producer price index followed a 2% increase in November. Industrial production in the U.S. rose more than forecast in December, driven by demand for computers, home electronics, and automobiles. Production at factories, mines, and utilities rose 0.4% last month, following a 0.1% November drop. In earnings news today, AMR Corporation, the parent company of American Airlines, announced its first full-year profit since before the terror attacks of 2001 and a sign of recovery for the battered airline industry. Charles Schwab's corporation fourth quarter earnings more than doubled to lift the stock brokerage annual profit above $1 billion for the first time in company history. Your economic reports coming out tomorrow include CPI, housing starts, and the Philly Fed survey. Scheduled economics reports, excuse me, earnings reports coming out tomorrow include companies such as Banco Popular, Fifth Third Bank Corp, Harley Davidson, Merck, the Bank of New York, and United Health Group. Also, keep an eye on stocks with the Cheesecake Factory, Caremark RX, Cablevision Systems, Intel, and Southwest Airlines. That's it for this fine hump day. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you tomorrow.